88% of people on the autism spectrum of working age are unemployed. This is a nationwide problem which is soon going to become a crisis proportion and this is a small, small piece of what we hope will incubate into a major impact on unemployment for people on the autism spectrum. It helps people with, on the autism spectrum to be trained to have employment and to just fulfill their future goals. We want to make sure that we give people on the spectrum the same things that we wanted for ourselves, want for our grandchildren and our children. We want to make sure that we're giving them the opportunities that we've all had, be able to get a job, have a career, live as independently as possible, and live the American dream. One, One, two, three. Hi, we're here at this beautiful farm, Roses for Autism. Let's go see what they do to support adults on the spectrum. Come on. Hey, Nina, nice hey. to see you. Glad you came by today. Thanks for having us. Oh, anytime. Anytime we can spread the message is important. You know? Yeah, and our mission here. Do so you want to have a little tour today? Yeah, okay, let's go. Yeah. So is this? this is our packing room where we basically, the hub of the business. Um, we have a little IT area over there, but let's go back and uh, check out all the flowers. My name is Lori Gregan and I'm the Retail Operations Manager at Roses for Autism. And our mission is to transition young adults and adults on the autism spectrum out into the workforce. So they come here, spend some time with us, and then we tra hopefully transition them into other jobs that they're good at or related to what they're doing here. Every aspect of the business, we have a job here, and if we have to tweak it to fit their needs, to get them over the hump to become more of, more of a valuable employee, that's what we do here. So I've been a part of a support group for many years, uh -huh. and most of the people in the support group have kids who are uh, high school aged or younger, right. but we're always worrying what's about gonna happen. what's going to happen. Yeah. And that's basically why this was started. Roses for Autism was started about four years ago by Ability Beyond Disability, which is our parent company in Bethel, Connecticut, which is a nonprofit that services all disabilities. Um, and they found that there were a lot of kids on the autistic spectrum that really didn't need full-time care or, or be housed. What they needed was to learn how to work successfully at a job. Okay, so we got 80 done. Awesome. We go through the B Bureau Rehab Service. Um, they'll set them up to come for an assessment. If they like it, then we will do the on-the-job training um, piece of it or whatever mm -hmm. to help them get to the next level um, and then we send an employment specialist out with them to maybe to another business. So we love having any businesses that would like to take one of our folks and then we transition to them. That's the real goal behind this. So what do you like about working here? Uh, just working with the roses and everything and helping to uh, put them together. Uh, well we uh, we sort through the roses here on the grading machine and uh, we just go by uh, the quality of like, you know, the stem, whether it's straight or not, and the rose head. People on the spectrum make great employees because they're very focused on their job um, and they want to do a good job, especially when they have an opportunity to work in a social setting where they feel um, challenged and enabled and cherished for the fact that they're doing a great job. Roses for Autism is a perfect example of how government and private enterprise can come together to provide these necessary services. How incredible is this, that there's a place that's strengths-based in their approach to working with our kids. There's no can't in my world. It's how are we going to do it, how are we going to approach it, and maybe we have to turn around, come back through the door, and look at it a different way, but that's what we try to you know, do every day. What a beautiful place this is. Imagine if there were more places like this everywhere so that all of our kids could learn skills they need to work successfully as adults. We could have a much lower unemployment rate, way down from 88%. Job well done, Roses for Autism.